Hello, my old school soul food family. Chef Jeffrey back with another video. All right, y'all. This is Vlogmas 14. This is December 14, y'all. And we're getting into some Christmas candy, y'all. I'm going to throw a little Christmas candy in there. This ain't really Christmas. You can have this all year long. But Christmas time, definitely people uh, share this as gifts throughout the Christmas season. Old school peanut brittle. Or peanut, I ain't peanut patty, but peanut brittle. My mama used to make this religiously, especially through the holiday season. It's very simple, very to uh, make, especially if you got a candy thermometer, it makes it even better. I, I made it without the candy thermometer, but get you one of these, cost about, what, five bucks or so. You get on Amazon. A lot of uh, cooking specialty stores have it. But let me tell you what we have here, y'all. We got some raw pecans, raw blanched pecans here, with the shell with the with the red off of it. We got some water. So I got salted butter. If you don't have salted butter, you're gonna put some salt in it. But I put the used salted butter, a little baking soda, a little vanilla, granulated sugar, and corn syrup. And what I got a double recipe here, y'all. You'll see the recipe. It might look like more than what the actual recipe is calling for in the bottom so that's why so anyway y'all this is very simple here we're gonna move over to the pot we're gonna bring four things to the till it gets the temperature of 300 degrees we're gonna put the uh we're gonna put the sugar in here y'all we're gonna put the corn syrup in here get it all up in there good Put the water in here and the peanuts. We're going to turn this on and we're going to bring this to a boil and let it cook until it get up to 300 degrees. Once it gets to 300 degrees, that's the, that's really the 300 degrees I usually tell you on here. That's the hard crack stage. That's what you want. That's what you're looking for. And you need to make sure you stir this constantly y'all so your peanuts don't burn because if you don't the peanuts will burn on the bottom so you got to make sure you definitely keep stirring it and uh when we come back let me get this boiling when we come back once you get 300 degrees and once you when we come back we're gonna uh add our butter bacon soda and vanilla and I got a pan already sprayed here, y'all. We're going to pour it on the pan, spread it out. Very simple, very easy. Don't take long at all. Old school peanut brittle. Blog was day 14, just getting started. Be right back. All right, y'all, we at 300 degrees here. Now, all I'm going to do now, y'all, we're going to put our butter in here. This one, you got to really act fast. We're going to put our baking soda in there. It's going to puff up a little when you put your baking soda. And we're going to put our... You take this thermometer out of here. This one you gotta move really, 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 really fast, y'all. Really fast. See that? Gotta really move fast on this. See that? Now we're gonna pour it over here in my pan. See pan here? Pan here. Let me move y'all over here. Move y'all over. We're just gonna spread this out, y'all. Spread this out here. There we go. Spread it out there. There we go. I like to spread it out right when I put it on the sheet pan. That way. I mean, right when I, after I put the, put my baking soda in there, that way it doesn't clump up on me. See that? Now, this is down, this is a little, y'all, let it kind of do its thing there. Now, we'll be right back here, y'all, and we're going to. Let it cool here, of course. Then we're going to come back. 
and we're going to break it up right off the sheet pan. This thing is hot, y'all. Hope y'all can see that. Can y'all see that? Yeah. Hope y'all can see that. There we go. How pretty that is. But, you know, it definitely got to cool. It's going to have to cool about, really about 15, 20 minutes. That's all it takes for it to cool. We'll come break it up. And we'll show you some old school peanut brittle. See how easy that was? So anyway, we all we'll be right back. All right, y'all, we are back here. Okay, y'all, let these things cool about. Matter of fact, it's been longer than 35 minutes. And what you do, y'all, you just kind of crack them up here. See that? See that? Kind of put your little spoon there. Kind of crack them up. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get them cracked up here, y'all, and I'm gonna put them on a the platter there. And I'll be back, and we gotta see how they taste, y'all. We gotta see if they the real deal, y'all. Old school peanut brittle, y'all. We'll be right back. All right, y'all, we are back here. Look at this here. Now, y'all can package this up here and sell it and sell it. Well, you can sell it if you want to, but uh, give it as way as Christmas gifts. And where I do mine, y'all, hold on just a second. Just a second here. I'll take mine. Here's something I did uh, a few months ago. And I'll put it in my food saver bag like this. And I'll, you can put this in a little de 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 decorative tin or a decorative bag, Christmas bag, and throw that in there. And that'll be nice Christmas gifts. Make sure you put it, if you got a food saver, it's even better so it'll last longer. You, my Annie, I have two Annies. Uh, my brother and my brother. My daddy's siblings, baby and sisters. Uh, she absolutely loves this. She come over to my house, say, I got some Annie, I got some. And she will literally take them all if I let her. So I think I'll say something. <laughs> yeah, she loves peanut brittle. Both of my Annie. So anyway, y'all, just a little. Uh, Christmas uh, idea for y'all look easy Christmas candy. Like I say, you get it up to 300 degrees, add the uh, vanilla, the uh, butter, and the, and the baking powder, not baking powder, baking soda. Put it on the pan, spread it out, and let it cool about 30, 45 minutes. That's what you got, old school peanut brittle. Very easy, very simple, y'all. So anyway, Vlogmas 14 is almost <laughs> it's in the books here. So anyway, if you like this video, please share, please comment, please subscribe. Please follow my other social media account, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch TV, Pinterest, and OldSchoolSoulFood.com. Remember the hashtag 2023 just shows some kindness. Old School Soul Food. Until next time, have a blessed Old School Soul Food Day. And I will definitely see y'all in the next video. Vlogmas Day 14, done.